Hello everyone, my name is Jezaj Patel and you are watching Jezaj Patel official YouTube channel. Welcome to the part 37 of responsive e-learning website development in PHP with PDO. So guys, in last tutorial, we successfully created this login form from here. So guys, in this tutorial, we are going to working on this sign up section. But before you do that, just uh, looking here, is the extra spaces are coming here. You can see that just because we doesn't use a uh, box sizing border box from here. So first of all, we are going to use that uh, border box from there. So wasting of time, let's get start. So from here, um, let's find out the menu. Here it is. Here, 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 here. From here. on that li 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 yeah just look at here we use here a padding from here so we need to set here box sizing border box property refresh that one you can see okay let's uh, clear the history from here clear browsing data clear data uh, let's refresh and check Okay, again is coming. Okay, just because we need to add that one from here. Let's refresh it now. Okay, again is coming. What's the matter? Is coming from here. Let's set this onto the main ally. Refresh it. You can see that now. Now the extra space is gone. You can see that. No extra spaces are coming. So in the same way we are going to use here uh, sign up form. So again going to the header.php. What we are going to do here just simply copy this all from here. And then paste that one. from here no need this uh, login this one is not needed we will remove that one so here sign up and here user plus okay as the same way uh, let's see which fields we collect that one from here uh, Name email phone and password name email name so first of all Set with the email. Okay. 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 Let's copy this one from here Paste that one from here and say user S underscore name S underscore email which means sign up user and sign up email enter user name okay as the same way mm -hmm, we use here phone number so we set here phone S underscore PHN which means phone enter your enter your phone number okay here also your and here is also your okay then after the password is as same we have here as pass one sign up password one enter your password we are going to copy this one again by control C, paste that one from here. By control V, set with the two and 
and we said re-enter your password okay it doesn't need the forgot password from here so we will not use that one from here and we use here a uh, sign up here we need to also give the name s sign up okay and here we need to give the name equal to login okay let's refresh and check what we have here oh not like no no not one from there okay so 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 the next task is come back again from here and let's copy this login this all from here by control c paste that one from here by control v change the id we are going to change the id from here now let's see what we have here refresh it so you can see that the sign up form is also coming perfectly very perfectly very perfectly coming so 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 head login copy this one paste that one from here and change it with this one refresh it you can see that but well, we need to change the color so let's change the color cut it from here by control exit control v it refresh the page you can see that the perfect output is coming perfect output perfect only we need to do one thing set the margin from top 2% let's see the output refresh it you can see that the button margin is coming perfectly these all are coming very good very perfectly very perfectly perfect output as we have here we can same output from here okay so and one more thing guys just look at this one when we are going to hover on this so just look at this one and then just look at this one nothing is going to happen so we need to fix this out from here with the yeah yeah, yeah. just here just here when someone hover on that button then it's uh, background will be has e6 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 okay let's refresh and check you can see that now and also we need to change it with the cursor cursor pointer let's refresh it you can see that that's nice looking very good very good perfect output perfect output so all are coming perfectly so guys uh, i think our home page is designing uh, home page designing is completed so in next tutorial what we are going to do here we are going to get the, all the links from here this is our main link our website owner link which is uh, in next tutorial we are going to working with the php script and we will target that link and then uh, we get that links from there into the database okay let's see the admin section from admin contact us page yeah here is the all the links are available so we will display this uh, link from here from now just look at here nothing is go oh no not from there from here no links are appear from here just look at this now nothing when i click on this one so you can observe here has is coming so just look at this one 
and now just look at look at this one nothing is coming from here but when i click on this one so hash is coming from here you can see that so we will remove this hash from here and we set the dynamically uh link which is coming into the our contact page from here you can see that we will display these links from here so how can you do that so we will see a, this one in next tutorial so guys i think this is enough for today if you guys are like my videos then like and share my videos and if you have any question in your mind then comment below and don't forget to subscribe to the channel when i upload the new videos then you can get the direct notification into your inbox so press the subscribe button okay and stay connected with me stay tuned we'll meet you in next tutorial goodbye